If you guys want to support me, then make sure to hit that red subscribe button below the video. And also, guys, make sure to hit the bell icon to get notified of all of my new uploads. Alright guys, it's your boy Get Off My Beard coming at you with a brand new GTA 5 video. And today guys, I'm going to be doing an outfit guide. There is no glitches involved with this guide guys to create this outfit. I just want to go ahead and let that you know that now in the beginning. But it is a really good outfit guide that I think you guys will enjoy. So what you guys are going to want to do is go ahead and make your way over to any barber shop because that's where we're going to start. Once you guys have made it to the barbershop, go ahead and simply walk inside and let's get into this. Oh yeah. So guys, as you can see, we are over here at the barbershop. So I'm going to go ahead and walk inside and I'm going to go ahead and go up to the hostess and go ahead and start up the ability to get a modified look. Now guys, the first thing that I want to do is go ahead and go over to hairstyles and we're going to go ahead and select this faux hawk hairstyle that you guys can see I'm doing here on screen. The reason we want to go with this guys is because we're going for a different look for the Joker. Most people do the really greasy, crazy hair coming down look, but this one guys is more of his professional, put together, ready to actually kick some butt look. So here's what we're going to do guys, once we've done that, we're going to go ahead and change the color of that hair over to the greenish, it's like a dark green type of emerald green looking hair. And that's the color that we're going to want. So once you guys have done that, then we're going to go ahead and select the face paint section. And under the face paint section, guys, we want to go ahead and actually select clowning. The reason we want to select clowning, guys, is because it's the closest looking one that we have since and if you don't have the Halloween update face paints if you do then make sure to use the actual Joker one because it does really complete the outfit but from here guys you can simply lower the opacity on this face paint quite a bit and you'll see it actually looks pretty dope and kind of gives you that Joker-esque that we are actually searching for and looking for Alright guys, so next you want to make your way over to the tattoo shop and what you guys are going to want to do when you get to the tattoo shop guys is you actually want to go ahead and put tattoos on both of your arms. Now guys, you're then going to make your way over to the clothing store and what you guys are going to want to do is select all of the options that I have selected here. I am going to go ahead and speed this film up so if you need to make sure to pause the video so that you guys can actually get the names of the clothes that I'm using but I didn't want to waste a bunch of time here in the clothing store so I'm just going to simply fast forward through a lot of this stuff. And as I said before guys, if you do need to actually see the names of these, then you can go ahead and pause the video. I tried to leave enough time while hovering on them so that you guys can actually select the different tops, bottoms, and shoes that you're going to need. And then guys, when you're done, make sure to take the parachute off if you already have it on. And then guys, we're going to go ahead and just do a simple walkthrough around the room. And that's going to be the outfit guys. I hope you enjoyed this outfit guide. If you did, make sure to hit the like button down below because it really does help me out guys. And also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe for more awesome GTA 5 videos. You guys are definitely going to like the next outfit guide that I'm doing on Willy Wonka, so be sure to stay tuned for that this week. It's been your boy, Get Off My Beard, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!